Hey, it's Sparky, and I have uh, just a couple pictures here to show you of a three-phase panel and a little of the misconceptions that I'm reading about on some of the forums and uh, actually a few people that I've worked with over the last few months. But uh, some people will take a look at these panels. This is a three-phase four-wire. So you got a black, a red, a blue, and a neutral. And... Um, a lot of people kind of think sometimes that the the phases this is this is one side and this is another side well it doesn't make sense with a three phase panel that you only got the two sides these are numbered uh, 1 3 5 7 9 11 13 15 17 all the odd numbers and on this side's 2 4 6 8 10 12 on down the line and as you can see these guys they did a good job of this panel I think it turned out really good but uh, what I'm going to show you in the, in the next couple pictures is actually the busing on this and how, how this three phase works between the breakers. So you've got a black phase, a red phase, and a blue phase, A, B, and C. Uh, put all three of them together on a, under one breaker and you've got a three phase breaker, three phase for motors, air conditioners, so on and so forth, or the single pole breakers, uh, lighting, general recepts. And then a uh, two-pole breaker maybe for your uh, water heater or could even be another motor or something like that. But uh, if you take a look at this panel, a couple things to note. They have, this is a sub-panel. They have their neutral is isolated from the ground off the back. And they have their separate ground bar down here. And in this case, they even have a isolated ground bar in here. So... This panel is a, a pretty clean panel to show you. So let's take a look at this uh, next photo and what I'll explain to you is that there's jumpers, bus bars in between these and that's how you're getting your three phases. That phase, that phase, and that phase. Now this is a, a different panel on another job that we haven't put breakers in yet and I think this will give you a pretty good idea. Um, that last panel, let me go back to it real quick, this is what you call a main lug only panel. And then in this one is a uh, main circuit breaker panel. And we'll get into the differences why there's a, a main lug only and a main circuit breaker uh, later on. For right now I just want you to kind of take a look and understand how this busing works. So what you have here is you've got your in this case would be the black, the red, the blue. The neutral bar is not in right now and, and neither is the ground but that's not what I'm concerned with showing you right now. This is the A phase, B phase, C phase. If you look on down here every three spaces it changes. So you've got your A phase, you got a B phase, you have a C phase. See how you got those jumpers in there between the A and the C going over into the middle and then your breakers are going to tie into those screws there. And I'll flip this back just a second. There's all your landing screws, bolt on breakers. This is a, a BAB style breaker panel. And just look on down the line here and you'll see every three spaces so you got black red blue black red blue black red blue black red blue on your top here you have breaker one breaker two circuit one circuit two and those are both on the A phase you've got uh, three and four on the B phase five and six is on the C phase so that's kind of uh, just kind of a layout of how the three phase panel works. Single phase panel is about the same with the exception you just don't have that that uh, extra phase in there and the extra set of busing. It's just it, every other one would go uh, A, B, A, B, A, B. But in this one being a three phase um, that's how you get the individual phases on each side. And when you go down uh, this would be uh, one, three, five, seven. So one and seven is on the same phase, A phase. Now we'll take a look at the, the back side of this panel, uh, the interior. 
and they just have straight bussing going all the way down. So the key to it is really on the other side. Hopefully I uh, explained that enough for you to, to understand what the three phase panels look like and that you don't have one phase all the way down one side and one phase down all the way to the other side. They, they crisscross or they, they're horizontal from each other and then as you go down vertical they start changing from A phase, B phase, C phase. Shoot me an email, post down below, um, let me know if you got any questions and we will get into the circuit breaker versus main lug only in another video. But uh, that's it for right now. Hey, thanks for watching. Have a great day. If you guys like these kind of videos, uh, let me know and um, you know subscribe and give the thumbs up on it so I can know what you guys are after. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.